what's happening YouTube lights are going down on the reef tank um hopefully I could shoot this video this is my third try we're having a storm here and power is going in and out which is actually really weird because I've never really had to worry about the power in this house but for some reason today it's not cooperating with me um this video I'm gonna kind of do a little overview of my sump and what runs this tank um little disclaimer when I started building this system I was really taking my time to get it how I wanted it um, I basically had it done and then I don't I don't know what I did but uh, none of the plumbing was cooperating with me um, I was getting all sorts of leaks and stuff so cut it all out probably redid the plumbing like two or three times and um, the end result is not as pretty as I envision it to be but whatever it works maybe my next system um, it'll be a lot cleaner but start off the pump I run it's the Jabo 100 watt DC pump um, really good pump I know they got a bad rep of not lasting all that long I think I've had this about a year and so far no problems pretty simple increase it or decrease it increase it feed mode works pretty well um, the sump I have on here it's the ice cap this is like the 30 gallon model I believe um, really good sump built really well I like the, the setup of it the only problem is um, this is the biggest one they had at the store at the time and I was a little impatient and um, I wish I had gone a lot big, bigger for 125 gallon I could more than enough room to fit a larger sump in there. Wish I had done that. Um, first compartment, kind of got your spillover bubble trap, whatever you want to call it, into um, supposed to be two filter socks. What I decided, since it doesn't have a a compartment for a refugium, I just took out one filter sock, filled about half of that up with chato. Um, not really ideal, not a really big compartment for a refugium, but I just thought I'd give it a try, see how it works. And the Chato's actually grown really well in this sump. Um, I'm not sure if it really does a whole lot because it's such a, a small little uh, refugium for a 125-gallon tank, but um, Chato's growing, so that's at least a good sign. Um, honestly, I, I really couldn't tell you if it's worth it throwing the extra filter sock back in there or having the refugium but for right now I'm just trying that out and see how it goes uh, for my protein skimmer I actually just got this a couple days ago this is the bubble magnus uh, curve 7 I had the curve 5 on there I'm gonna put the 5 back on the 75 but um yeah with the curve 5 it was just way too small I mean it's a good protein skim skimmer it was pulling out a lot of gunk but um, I wanted a, a beefier skimmer for the larger system so I threw this on here a couple days ago I mean didn't take long at all to break in and dial it to where I want it so I'm um, really pulling some nasty junk really love this skimmer though things a, a beast um, Back there I have a heater. I also have a heater and a backup heater and that overflow over there. Um, I couldn't even tell you what heaters I use. I use the titanium ones without the controller because I just run it through my Apex. But um, those heaters, they seem to hold up pretty good for me. No complaints on that. Um, back here, that's my return pump. And for some reason I decided to run... GFO again, just my phosphates are way too high, they're like 0.36 in this tank and that's just, that's unacceptable so basically trying anything just to slowly lower them um, see if that works out I've, I've always been against GFO ever since it crashed one of my other systems but um, starting off slower in this one, see how it goes and then this is just your RO reservoir, I got the the utility pump from Neptune. That pump is a beast. I love that pump. But yeah, guys, just quick little overview. Quick.
quick little look at the tank as the lights are going down. Um, I do have plans for that. I got the 26 up there. And you see that black bar right there with the light spread. So I do have some plans for uh, new lighting in this tank, but that will be in the future. Alright, later guys.